America Forecast with Coin 6 Chief Meteorologist Bruce Sussman. All right, I want to start with pictures from Albany today. Around midday, did you hear about this funnel cloud that formed? Lots of folks were able to photograph it, including Mark of the, the uh, Democrat uh, Herald down there. And uh, here's another shot from David Reynolds. Look at this thing. I mean, this is a beautifully formed funnel cloud just east of town. It was in the air showing signs of rotation for about 15 minutes and then it vanished. Never did touch down, otherwise I'd be calling it a tornado. There's another view of it from our coin viewer, Mark uh, Chevalier, and you can see right there, there's the funnel cloud kind of at an angle there almost now. So uh, usually these form in days like today where it's chilly, the air is kind of somewhat unstable, and we've got some ominous clouds around, and boy, that's what happened today, and the thing didn't touch down. So that's the good news. Now that kind of weather, what can create it is leaving town as we speak. We're going to clear our skies tonight. It's going to be a chilly night. Watch for fog if you're out later this evening. Some patches by mid-evening more uh, widespread by late evening. And then tomorrow morning, areas of widespread fog and morning clouds probably around two. And then we're breaking up the fog and clouds by lunchtime. And it's a gorgeous fall afternoon on the way. I'm really excited about that. And you better act fast because our dry weather only holds for one day, if you can believe that. So tonight, the last few showers are moving south. We've got a few sprinkles in the metro area, but not much left. The best line is from Dayton, Woodburn, and on over to Malala. All of that's moving to the south right now.